Here's a quick video about the degree of unsaturation of an organic molecule. Degree of unsaturation is a way for you to turn the molecular formula into information about its structure. The number of rings and pi bonds, that's one for a double bond or two for a triple bond, is going to be equal to this formula where we have the number of carbon atoms, the number of hydrogen atoms, the number of halogen atoms, F, C, L, B, R, and I, and the number of nitrogen atoms. Let's plug these into, let's plug a couple of these into the formula, see what we get, and trust ourselves that it's true. So, benzene C6H6 will have a degree of unsaturation of number of carbon atoms, 6, minus number of hydrogen atoms, 6, divided by 2, minus halogen atoms divided by 2, not an issue, plus nitrogens divided by 2, not an issue, plus 1. That's 6 minus 3 plus 1, which makes 4. If you take a look at the structure of benzene, there is one ring, and there are three pi bonds. Each pi bond, if you're not familiar, is the second and third bond between any two atoms. So these are the three pi bonds, and obviously we have a ring because it's a hexagon. One and three make four, that's not a coincidence. Here, I want to admit, you know, let's count up the number of rings and pi bonds first and convince ourselves that we're going to get the right answer there. Let's count the rings, one, two. Well, that was easy. Two rings. How many pi bonds do we have? Well, we have one here, one here, one here, and one here. That makes four pi bonds. So I'm guessing that our degree of unsaturation should come out to six. All right. Let's see. The degree of unsaturation for this molecule is carbons, 8, minus hydrogens over 2, that's 10 over 2. There are no halogens, so I don't have to worry about that. But there are nitrogens this time, so I will add 4 over 2. Then I will also add 1. That gives me 8 minus 5 plus 2 plus 1. 8 minus 5 is 3, plus 2 is 5, plus 1 is 6. Ah, the system works. If you have the molecular formula, or rather, yeah, the molecular formula, you can get information about how many rings and or pi bonds there are with degree of unsaturation. I've personally only used this in a structure course where they give you the molecular formula because we determined it with mass spectrometry and other stuff, and then you have to propose a structure. If your degree of unsaturation is six, and you don't propose a structure with two rings and four pi bonds, or you know some combo that adds to six, you best believe you're getting it wrong, because this system works. Degree of unsaturation, best of luck.